Hi everyone, this is Sinan from Car Inspected, and today we're at a local Toyota dealership in the greater Montreal region. Uh, we're taking a look at this 2004 Toyota Camry. You might say, why is a 2004 Camry being sold by the dealer? Well, you're about to find out. So we're starting with the walk around. Uh, the car was outside. It's a pretty cold day today. It's about minus 30 uh, Celsius for anybody watching from the US or UK. There's hardly any imperfections on this car. Um, the tires are the Michelin X-Size Winter, but there are 5.30 seconds remaining on the tread depth, and to my surprise, they're from the 11th week of 2004. Uh, these are 15-year-old tires. I'm impressed. Um, I, I would still recommend changing them. This is an all original manufacturing of uh, manufacturing date of this car. It's a little imperfection here. This one was made on the first week, or sorry, first month, January of two thousand four. Now, mileage is 75,000 kilometers. Not miles, kilometers. It's a one owner vehicle, you can tell, you can see it. And it's been well cared for. What you see here is uh, anti-corrosion coating. So that's not rust, that's anti-corrosion or anti-rust. Same thing here. Trunk. Practically new. And back then, you, they used to supply cars with a full size spare, which is uh, quite nice. That's a good year. And it was made on the second week of 2004. That's the net. There you have the the jack. I did fold the seats. Everything worked as expected. No issues there. It's a little bit of oil here. Um, you can see it's removable. That oil was from the uh, anti-rust uh, or anti-corrosion treatment. No smell of any kind. Um, no smoker. Uh, no oil or 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 any of that. Since we're in the rear, just uh, show you the condition of the undercarriage there. Some surface rust, very, very minor for a 2004. That's the cleanest I've seen. All tires match. No leaks from the shocks and uh, AC works. 
air conditioning works. You can see the car was parked outside, so it's a lot of uh, a lot of snow in there. The brakes in the front have been replaced; they're brand new, as well as the rotors. Original windshield. There are some dings, very minor scratches, but nothing uh, major at all. I left all the windows open because I'm going to be checking them. They did function fine, but and the mirrors as well. Under the hood, this is an all original VVTi 16 valve engine. My only comment. I left this open because I was testing the coolant freezing temperature, so I let the overflow, I, let, I put it here. My only comment is that the belt is a little bit shiny, it's still okay, but it's going to need to be replaced soon. Other than that, I really have no comments on the uh, condition of the engine bay. The battery seems to have been replaced recently. I checked the brake fluid uh, humidity content and the transmission fluid engine oil and coolant and power steering fluid everything checked out radiator is original paint thickness is all consistent and it's original On the interior, again, near perfect. I'm highlighting imperfections. Well, it's not even an imperfection there. This is usually rusty on a lot of the Camrys. So this one is in perfect shape. I did a computer scan engine, transmission, airbag, ABS systems, all passed. Um, but because of the maintenance that was done recently, it seems like the codes were uh, recently deleted. They normally do that when they do maintenance on the car. Um, they do something called a quick erase. And they just remove the codes, any pending codes, etc. It's got ABS. Right up. No warning lights. AC is working. Radio is working. There is no user manual though. No broken trim pieces or anything. Wipers. Headlight option on auto. They used to care back then. I've seen some much newer cars that don't have the auto option. I left the AC on just to show you. But fan is working. That's the floor fan. And then here. Everything's in perfect shape. <laughs> Air conditioning. So uh, the video is, well, the middle of the image is the AC compressor. And uh, it will engage shortly, so you'll see it the whole pulley will be turning. There you have it. And it will disengage, so when it engages the fans turn on. So everything is working as expected. 
I'll turn off the uh, engine because we're indoors. Don't want to leave it on for too long. Just testing a few things. That's it. There you go. Turn off the and that's why you have them you have the auto option. A lot of times you can kill the battery just by forgetting the uh, headlights on. And in this cold weather it doesn't even take an hour to kill the battery. final walk around there are some dings you can see them in the reflection but other than that it's really really clean that's a very good example of a, a 2004 Camry I'd replace the tires put in a fan belt or accessory belt and uh, Oil has been changed recently too, so undercarriage from the front. No issues whatsoever. All right, we're about to take the car for a test drive. This has been uh, Sinan from Car Inspected, and that was a pre-purchase inspection on this 2004 Toyota Camry four-cylinder in the Greater Montreal region. Thank you for watching.